A bizarre and concerning incident took place at New York JFK Airport on June 17th. On this day, an ETA Airways Airbus A330-200 reportedly struck an Air France Boeing 777-200 while taxiing for departure. Unaware that it had done so, the A330 continued with its takeoff and completed its flight to Rome. Let's take a look at this extraordinary incident in today's video. On Friday, June 17th, an ETA Airways jet, still in Alitalia livery, was about to begin flight AZ611 from New York to Rome Fiumicino. The aircraft was an Airbus A330-200 registered Echo India Echo Juliet Lima, which is at present roughly 10 years old. Taxiing towards the runway for departure, the jet clipped an Air France Boeing 777-200 registered Foxtrot Golf Sierra Papa Quebec, which had arrived from Paris. While the crew of the ETA Airways A330 was completely oblivious to a collision, the Air France jet was well aware of what had happened. Reacting quickly, the 777's crew urged ATC to keep the ETA aircraft on the ground. Yes, it is Air France 008. We are on standard 9, and there is an Alitalia passing behind us that hit our aircraft. Uh, it's very dangerous for him uh, not to take off. Could you say this again, please? You're saying that the Alitalia aircraft hit you? However, by the time the situation was understood by ATC, the A330 was already in the air and on its way across the Atlantic. ATC contacted the ETA Airways jet and asked about the incident, but the crew denied that it had been involved in any kind of incident while taxiing towards takeoff. The following conversation took place between air traffic control and the ETA Airways jet. Another uh, aircraft uh, on the ground currently, Air France, said that you hit them or something of that nature while you were taxiing. Did you uh, experience any uh, damage to the aircraft? Negative, sir. While the ETA Airways crew may have denied that any collision occurred and genuinely believed this to be the case, it would ultimately prove to be false. According to reporting from ABC News, upon landing in Rome, wing damage was discovered on the A330. Details of the specific damage and its severity were not disclosed. However, we do know that the Air France jet is still parked at New York JFK. At the time of this video's production, nearly two weeks have passed. This length of time out of service could indicate severe damage to the 777. As for the ETA A330, the aircraft touched down in Rome on June 18th and was on the ground for roughly two days. Seemingly an easy fix, the jet's next service would be a flight to Tel Aviv, with subsequent flights taking place almost every day since. Speaking to ABC News, aviation analyst John Nance states that the responsibility of the ETA Airways crew was clear upon being informed of a collision. He absolutely should have turned the airplane around, brought it back to JFK for inspection. Indeed, with long-haul commercial aircraft being as large as they are, pilots may not notice incidents if they are minor enough. However, with the A330 departing with a cabin full of passengers, it's interesting that none of these travelers even noticed the incident. Or if they did notice, then perhaps failed to inform any of the airline crew. The FAA and ETA Airways are investigating the incident. What's your reaction to this strange event and the actions of ATC and the ETA Airways crew? Share your thoughts by leaving a comment. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.